Okay, so let's see. Hang on. Try to get this up a little bit. Let me see. What? I'm on. What else do you think you need? Okay, just hang on. No, we're on. Okay. Hi, guys. All right, let me just see if I can pull that. There we go. So this is the um, Tetrafauna Decorative Repto Filter. This is the new one that Petco just sent us. They got it. Uh, well, this is the new filter, Summerlang, for the new tank, yeah. But this is the one Petco sent this to us, uh, free of charge. They refunded our money for the one that was used, and they sent this from the Ithaca store, and it came to us in one day. So they really uh, stepped up to the plate, and uh, we spoke to Amber and um, to, I think the guy's name, Adam. In, in the other store in Vestal. So let's see if this is going to be good. It says open here. Let's see so. if you can see it. Now. And then you open this up right here, which I did peel it open a little bit, okay? Um, I didn't take anything out though. Oh, you don't? Okay, you so. like that. This way, let me just read about this out. So it's a full two year warranty on this. Clean, clear water from efficient three stage filtration. Easy to set up, easy to clean. Just replace the cartridge and it takes the cartridges. You have the cartridges that it takes? Um, there's some in there, should be. I know, I was gonna show. We have more. Um, no, they're the ones I bought. To okay. Just show that like the fish tank ones. Okay. Can you look at them? Yeah, so it says, just replace, I'll show you that realistic. Now, here's the reason I got this filter, is because if you know, turtle tanks are not full to the top the way a fish tank is, and that's why you always hear that um, sounds like a fountain's running in the background, because, um, well, like if you look here and the water's to here, if you have a regular aquarium filter, it's going to have a long fall. So that's why you hear it. Now this one, if you see, has this faux rock that the turtle can climb on and frogs and newts as well. I didn't know you could have those newts. Look, they have those little newts. Hmm. That's crazy. People can have those as pets, I guess. Oh, um, so yeah, I love those little newts. I used to I try to take them, they never lived. Um, when I was a kid, but anyway, so yeah, they have this rock formation So it makes the tank look much better than just like a black aquarium type of filter And it gives the turtle a place to climb or bask, right? Okay the filters you want to see. Now these are the filters that it takes so they're the regular you'll see Yeah, they're like you're a few familiar. bucks for that And these were on sale. These were only four dollars for three for a three pack Okay, so and this was uh, twenty five dollars. This was on sale at uh, PetSmart so yeah. The, the thing is, that also, a lot of the water evaporates. Now, this uh, filters up to 55 gallons, so we have a, we have a uh, what do we have, a 20-gallon tank 20, long. 20, yeah. yeah, so that's plenty. Powerful 90-gallon per hour pump with an 8-foot power cord and the realistic natural stone appearance. The decorative repto is ideal for low water level, 4 to 6 inches aquatic environments preferred by turtles, newts, and frogs. Okay, so let's see, and a dual-function lid. The lid on the decorative repto filter keeps reptiles out and doubles as a basking platform. So let's see now. Okay, and the other thing is that the, 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 our turtle, they even say that like he rips his food, he'll have it in his mouth and, and he'll like use his uh, paw like to, to, to pull it off and rip a piece off. And he makes a mess and they, they say to have a filter that's double your tank volume, which is, this is perfect. That's why, you know, we need, we got this one right here. Okay, so let's see. Let's see it. Okay, so our other one was not packed. Let's let them see this. Our other one was not packed like this. At all. At all. It was, um, there was nothing in plastic. It was just like a cord just plopped in there, right? Yep. And the, uh, the pump itself said 80 gallons per hour, not 90, which halted me right away. So let's see what we got here. Let's smell. It also smells a little different. Let me see if there's any scratches on the bottom. Yeah, a little bit, not much. That just probably, like just, just factory. probably from yeah, the factory to make sure the other one was really scratched. Okay, so let's see this right here. Um, I'm just gonna rip it over. I don't mind. Huh? Let's see over on here. It'll tell you this is your max water level and your minimum water level. So that's gonna be perfect because our minimum water level is gonna be that. Well, I got a knife. I should be open. And then this will go in the corner. And it doesn't take up you know, that much space, but it's uh, turtle can swim up on here. 
You can put other rocks yeah. so that they can get to the out. top. Yeah, it says you, you, so you showed them that, the maximum in here? Yeah. Yeah, so you still keep the water in there. And then the filters are go in here. Those, yeah. yeah. Uh, the filter will go like this. One goes here. So, oh, so it has two of them. Yeah, you got one here, so and, you put, and you put one in there, yeah. and you put the, let's check this pump out. And See. this goes like that, and then you can put, like, rocks over here so that he could get up here. What? It says the same thing. Are you serious? Yep. But at least it's new. It's new. That's really yeah. weird. Okay. So maybe that's just the maybe way it the goes. Box, I don't know, but at least the, the other one was Maybe you can like do this. 90, but it, it does say 80. But our other one wasn't packed like this. The other one wasn't packed at all. None of no. it was packed. The, the cord was all unraveled. So we've got so another filter here. That has to go in there. We have to, we and we've got this. Right yeah, that goes. I'll show you how to do that, how that goes. That's stuff. And then the that pump has a uh, little suction. Yeah, so it'll be like this. This guy will go in here like this. A little slot there. I think we, have to, I think we have to rinse these first. I think. Maybe, Maybe uh, to uh, get the charcoal. Yeah, and then this thing will go. This will go here. This will go here. Oops, it's stuck there. This is gonna go here like this. I'm gonna push that guy in there like that, and then it's gonna go. The cord's gonna be sticking out here. Let me pull a little bit of the cord out now. Okay, the cord will be in here. Can they see it? Yeah. The cord will go there. This thing will go here. There should be a little lip thing here for this. Oh, yeah. Right there. Yeah, here it is right here, this. Put it here so it doesn't, so it can stay like this little, so it won't go in, go out. And then, uh. That'll flow down the rocks. Let me make sure how we want it. And then, like that right there. Take this like that. Wait, that'll flow. Doesn't it have to go over this rock? How's it going to flow? Oh, no, no. It'll just, it's going to go it's in gonna, there. Oh, it's and the water's going to come up. out like that. Yeah. Oh. It's going to fill it up and just let the. The water just kind of run down there. So and it should we'll have water. Stay, it should we'll be... keep our water up to about to here. Our turtle will be running around on there. He'll be doing flips off of here and stuff like that, probably. Right? And right? then he could, yeah, he could even crawl down to here. And, we'll yeah. see, yeah. Let me see crawling, the water if he's yeah. that deep. If the water's up to here. Minimum is here. Yeah, he'll be able to climb up there. Minimum He's, he's, here, a, so he's an active feel guy, feel I'll tell you. He's very he'll active. Climb. He's a climber. I don't know. But tomorrow we'll like uh, we have want to wash the tank out and uh, wash that out. And too. also we'll wash Maybe. this too because you can t once you take this stuff out you can wash this whole thing and, and scrub it and yeah. you know so we'll wash that anyway just in case it has any oils from the factory or whatever. Um, wash that and then show you how we set up the new tank tomorrow. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, PetSmart did uh, do the right thing for us so yeah. just so an update on that. So apparently somebody opened up the other one. They they did whatever they did with it and um, and put it back in the box. Did you see? Did, and they did put you show the, them? The did you show tape. them the tape? Well, uh, did no. you show the other I, one? I did. I did well, I, I don't know if I. Yeah, I put it. So in somebody sn pulled one over. Pulled a fast one over on pet. Uh, yeah, no. you see how well, like, I'll show you. Show, see that? how these are normally like glued here. What they did? They put like gray duct tape in a loop. They, they took a loop of tape. And they and put it, here they put it up here and here back. so that it appeared to be sealed. And it, you know, it did. When I had to pull it, it pulled a little bit and then it came open. So, so they brought it back to PetSmart all nice and neat looking and all. And PetSmart didn't open it. They probably said, look, we never opened it. But they were lying. So they pulled one over on PetSmart and PetSmart took care of us. Good for them. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. But, uh, so they are on sale. If you can find one in yours, yeah. they're, they're 25. They're normally like, I mean, $45. They could be $45, $40. Well, you'll pay like 50 for shipping, all together yeah. with shipping. Yeah, and then if you pay shipping. Like so if you can find one in a PetSmart and you need one, you should check one out. And then these are on sale too. These are normally eight something for a three pack. They're four something at PetSmart. Uh, yes, we are wake up to that trick now. Oh, you Jim, yeah. yeah. Watch, watch your stuff and make sure that they're not putting it together with duct tape. Yeah, so, so they suck the water in here, I guess, and all the little holes right around here. All the water goes into there, and then it, uh, it goes through, through these filters, and then here, and the pump pumps it out here. And we have a nice little waterfall. You know, some what's that guy's name that Ross, Bob Ross? Bob Ross. Bob Ross. He probably painted something like this. Yeah, you know, nice kids, waterfall. right? But well, let's see what we have happy here. We have a tree. we have a little happy rock right here sticking out. You know. And then these see these oh. are all packed up nice. So. Yeah. 
And so they're the same. So they're the same thing as the... For, that's a good deal. If you have even a filter like this, they'll work in that too. So oh, yeah. that's the one we have one. now. But but it, that the one that one we have, we they have a big one. It's like dollars. that high. But it's it's only uh for like eight to fifteen gallon tanks or something. So we had a ten gallon tank with uh and only filled it third of the way full. That one right there, and it it's pretty quiet as long as you you know don't let the water run all the way down. But it 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 because it, it, it water evaporates all the time with this thing here. So you always have to keep the water up. You know, check the water up out on it. And I was just thinking of something funny. What the heck was it, honey? Oh yeah, yeah. These are the same. Fil these are the same filters, except they're different. Does yeah. that make sense? No. No, are they? No, no, no. I'm just saying they they look a little different, but it's kind of being funny. But they're they're the same. No, thing. they're the same. Yeah, they fit. You know, they're the same, but they're different. No, but that's a good deal because if you even have like somebody might not buy these because they say repto filter. But it, it'll work in your uh, regular yeah, be fine. Uh, fish tank. So yeah. We have the same one in black. It's not green. They'll work in it. Why pay eight dollars? This it's looks like it has water. much more uh, charcoal yeah. in it, which is going to take the, any smell that the turtle has out. But does that make any sense? They're the same, but they're different. Right. I said that. Same. You didn't say that. Yeah. So and and these are all. You know what the good thing about these? I'll tell you. For, the other ones we get, you have to put this charcoal in yourself. Oh yeah, I had a you, yeah. You, you had and you had a. Hopefully you didn't. Yeah, you don't uh, spill some any. Some of them the, there might not be enough of these. Yeah, that, so you, you got to gotta take, clip it yeah, in. You, yeah, you had to take this and put it onto that and, and open it up and dump the charcoal stuff in there and then close it up. Yeah, these ones all yeah, are all so set. Yeah, so if you can find really if you can find these, even if they say you don't if you use it for your fish tank, I think it's you don't have to mess with the charcoal. They're already fully assembled, and they're only four dollars. And your turtle will love you. And your turtle will love you. Our turtle loves this anyway. I, I can't believe how he, he, whenever we walk in the room, we like, you know, he just comes running over to the edge. He's pretty, you know, it's like, he's very, like he he's knows us. Very active. Very and, active. Um, they look. say, they, they say red sliders are similar. Red sliders, but they red, get much bigger, don't they? I don't know for sure. I, I know, we picked up the, um, the southern... Painted turtle, turtle, which is similar to a red slider, I guess, in behavior. No, we but wanted it. also is the smallest one, too. Yeah, well, we wanted the one like an eastern that's up here, but they didn't have any. Right, so we got a southern, any. but they maybe little, it was They're better. a little more colorful. Yeah, I like this one. I like the stripe it has, and also the fact that it may not get so big. It's one of the smaller ones. But painted turtles, as a rule, are smaller. The full grown ones in the lake are only like that big. That we see, the ones we see in our lake are about like that. Mm, I've never and seen them like that. I've seen them like that. Maybe, okay, so I'll give you that much. That's about, is, that's the one I saw in the lake. And This is a slider. That's a yellow belly slider, I think. Okay, yeah, they, they say the big. red sliders are really, really kind of fun. They're, they're, I mean, they're solo creatures, but this one, uh, you see what happens. We, we should film it. When I walk over there, or anybody else, he'll like run over to you, jump off the thing, and I put my hand in there, and he'll calm down and walk over to my hand, and... You know, but if you put your finger in there and he thinks it's food, he will take a little chomp out of it. <laughs> <laughs> but he doesn't have any teeth. Yeah, he doesn't want to. He doesn't want to bite. He'll let it go real quick. But if he just thinks it's food, he, he doesn't know. See, and these say they keep the water crystal clear. They remove odor and discoloration. Yeah, that's gonna be good. They they look like really good, B better than the ones we've been buying and putting yeah, in that one. Yeah, we've been using the fish tank ones. Yeah. So because, because turtles are messy. Charcoal. He you know he eats half his. I don't know if you. Feed him one or two things at a time. He'll, he'll you could see and he'll eat it, but you know other times you'll see like a grasshopper leg floating around in there. If he sees it, he'll still eat it. But sometimes it's, the filter has things moving around. And um, mm, these are these are this is a good deal. Yeah, uh, we're good. So anyway, um, I may order some more of these. It seems. Pe but, yeah, pet um, shop did as well. I, I think we're gonna have to because they, they get messy with him in there. Yeah, and this is a really good deal. So. Yep. Uh, hopefully, I don't know if any of you have turtles or newts or frogs. We want to get one. But I want to get one. Yeah, um, we'll show you the uh, turtle tank tomorrow because we just have to get that all washed yeah. out. Yeah, we'll wash he's gonna like his new environment and have a lot more room. I'll have double the room, double the room he has. So that'll be good. And um, I'm going to. I'm, I was going to attempt to do a video of cutting a glass bottle would, um, and I'll and I'll make a new video right after this. Would you be interested in me trying the, the glass bottle cutter again? Let me know. 
I talked to my nephew today. My nephew is four years younger than me. So um, he does a lot of DIY. He makes his own kombucha. And I asked him about it, and he told me all about it. And I said, you know, people said not to make my own kombucha because I'll die. And he said, no, what is that name of the bacteria thing he gets? What is it, Sco Scooby? A Scooby? A Scooby? Uh, I forgot what you call it. Yeah, he said it looks like it looks he like says it a, looks like a jellyfish. Yeah, I forgot what he called it. And cool. he says his kids don't like it, and uh, it looks like a jellyfish. But uh, don't forget the goggles. Yeah. Um, hi, Florida Gray Lady. Oh, you, you, know, you know what we had them go to? Oh, my gosh. I got Florida Gray Lady, I've got to download and pull those videos out. We had Scooter and Florida Gray Lady go to, because they laughed that I ordered a cold brew iced coffee. I said, can you make that hot at Starbucks, right? And they, and they said, and Lisa D. said, Carolyn, you did not. You did not do that. I said, I did. And then I said, wouldn't it be funny if someday Lisa D. and I and Scooter could get in a car and then go to a Starbucks and act really, really naive and say, like, what is a, a cold brew coffee? I don't understand. Can you get it? And just, just have the whole thing, like, be really, really thick, right? So then Scooter said, I'll do it right now. So Scooter jumped in the car. We had her on Zoom. And she went to Dunkin' Donuts. She said, what is that uh, cold brew coffee? And the guy's like, well, we put that in the cooler for 24 hours. It's brewed this way. It's brewed that way. She goes, can I get that hot? And he goes, no, you can't get that hot. And she goes, really, you, I can't get that hot? So how is that different from the iced coffee? So then she goes, yeah. he goes on and on, and she asks him all this stuff. And then she goes, okay, then I'll just take the regular iced coffee with a little cream. And then she gets up to the window, and she goes, don't you think that would be a good idea that maybe you guys have that cold brew coffee hot? And he goes, <laughs> no, we can't do that. So then Florida Gray yeah, Ladies yeah. goes in that little uh, what a, slingshot, right? Oh, yeah. She goes to the Dunkin' Donuts, and she says uh, she's going to tell them, because they said the coffee stays out overnight, it's 24. She's going to say, why would I want stale coffee? Yeah. Right? So she goes up to the place, and she goes, what is that cold brew coffee? And they tell her the same thing. And she goes, so wait a minute. How much is the cold cup of the cold brew coffee? So they're like, whatever, three twenty nine or whatever. How much is a cup of the regular coffee? Two she goes, so I'm going to pay more for coffee that's been out all night? <laughs> stale coffee? <laughs> And the lady's like, and the lady, instead of saying no, she goes, yeah. She goes like that, yeah. Mm -hmm. And she goes, well, then just forget it. I don't even want it anymore. And she took off. Well, so you got to tell everybody what the slingshot is. Some of people know, but they don't. Some people they may not know, right? A slingshot, it's like one of those things you go, ping, ping. No, actually, it's a motorcycle. The one with the two wheels in the front and the one wheel in the back. That's yeah, what I, I wanted to tell you that. Yeah, so she drove, other she's driven around it. Yeah. Yeah, so just wanted to say that to you. So you, you, some of you but I'm folks maybe knew and thought we're talking about a slingshot. She, yeah, I did. I did the first time. She said, "I said you're going to get a slingshot," and and she's like, "No, Carolyn, it's a, not that kind of slingshot." Seems like a lot safer than a regular motorcycle. Like if a deer ran out. Oh yeah, her. she drives it like all over. Yeah. Hi, Lisa D. Your package was mailed out today. Yeah. Um. So, yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, um, I've got to separate those videos, and then I think we can do more. Like, we're going to have people go to McDonald's and be like, we said, we said uh, Scooter and I went to McDonald's and say, hi, I know this is going to sound strange, but we've never been here because we were Amish. And most, most Amish people, you know, uh, they, they're 15 years old and they decide if they want to be or not. We took a little longer, but we really, we've never been to a McDonald's. Like, could you explain what the, you know, which, what would you have for the first time? You know, and do stuff like that. So. Gotta make noise for me, honey. Yeah, okay. Oh, to see if it's kangaroo meat, yeah. Um, so we, I'm going to put those in their own. You don't need to have a motorcycle license to drive those keep it kind of Okay, so do you want to see me cut the bottle? I'm going to make a new, I'm going to make a new video. I'm going to do it. I'm not afraid. Okay, I was talking to my nephew. He told me about the kombucha. He said, you will not die. He said he's been doing it for a long time. He has not died yet. Um, I just want to know if you would truly die or you would just get really sick. He said he's been using the same scuba. He showed me the, I, it's probably a scoby. I don't even know what the name of it is. Um, he said he got it off of Amazon, which sounds scary, but he said they sent it to him. It's a starter kit for kombucha. And he just puts it in a gallon with like six or seven different kinds of tea bags. He, he, he steeps the tea first, steeps the tea. Then 
he puts uh um, he puts the scoby or whatever it is yeah, in yeah, there yeah. so it looks like a jolly fish and i guess it has all the all the you know the little live uh bacteria you know probiotic stuff in it and he puts that in there and he said he keeps it in there i forgot how long a week maybe it takes maybe a week and then if he wants some fizz he'll take it and he'll put it in bottles With and he'll put about a spoonful of sugar and do it and then um and close the lid real I tight i think he said he puts like three quarters of a cup in the gallon didn't he say in the gallon no i thought he said he puts a sp- he in, e- in each bottle he'll he'll put a, a spoonful, spoonful of sugar seltzer, i thought he said no he said sugar <laughs> And then that'll react. That'll get it going. That'll give you. That'll give you some fizz. It's gonna give you some oh, you carbon don't have to dioxide. Put in there? He didn't mention that. No, okay. he said he put uh, just puts a teaspoon of sugar in it. Cl- closes the lid up. I don't know how long I could talk to him again. And you know, I'm sure there's instructions somewhere. He does that. And then when he was gonna when he's gonna drink it, if you want the flavor, you flavor it. Then he'll. Yeah, I forgot you what don't he said. Flavor it beforehand. He, he said, said he actually then, likes the uh, just plain. the regular plain. But you can flavor it with, um, put a little bit of orange juice, put a little bit of yeah, apple juice. Some stuff. Um, you can put a little bit Maybe of pineapple juice. Maybe lime will be good. He I said, bet you that. He, pineapple juice, you know, you can, the kind of things, ginger. Lime That's you know. what I say. Oh, the limes are recalled. Limes? Those limes I got in there? I don't know. Are they from uh, Wegmans? I don't know. Limes and lemons were recalled. Oh yeah, I Rice yet. was recalled. All onions were recalled. Red potatoes are recalled. I was, I was bought. I didn't use any of them. I have some limes in there. Okay. Let me take a look. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. I, I have to uh, see. I, I don't know. I, I, he thinks, let me see. what Limes. Okay. Doesn't say Premium. Where it these are Persian limes, so I doubt these. these well, no, I still want to find I, out. I, yeah, we got to find I'm out. I'm going to check and see. I don't yeah. know if these are stupid things. Yeah, check them out. You know, all the onions. All the onions. But I'm going to use the ones we use because how, how would that be? If we are, if we're going to cook them to death and there's a piece and there's something in there. So, but, um, yeah. I'm, uh, do you think I should try that kombucha? If you think I should try making my own kombucha, type, I really make a video of it. type a one if you think I should not try to make my own kombucha because I will die, um, or there's a good chance of me uh, make creating a bad... He said there's no chance of it, really. He said if there was ever a mold on it, then don't drink it. Yeah, he said that, he said that the, the uh, you know, the, the live active... Uh, you know, stuff in it may have a little film that goes down, little strings. Sort yeah. Of. They're fine. Strain it out. He, you know, he said they're fine. Oh, don't strain it out? Did he didn't say that. No, he, I didn't hear him say that. And then he said, that's probably, oh, that's, that's I guess what? Good stuff. He and his family are going to go to Lordville and they're going to go hike on that thing. Yeah. Because his wife, his wife is originally from even further upstate. Like an hour, like two, wait a minute, like three. Well, how far is Elmira? Elmira? That's out, that's out west. Uh, yeah, but it's, but it's uh, past Bing. It, it's at least oh, two yeah, hours from here. Yeah, yeah, way here. So on the other side of Binghamton. I think that's where we stopped. I think that's where we I got my kettlebell from. Yeah, we went up there. When I, I went, went to, to the wedding, too. Went to his name's funeral. But anyway, um, yeah. So his wife's from up that way, and she's a science teacher. So that's right up her alley. So they're going to go, and uh, I said, you got to go look at it. I can't emphasize how much they got to be staying on the trail. Watch out for rattlesnakes. Yeah, he, yeah. But Mike's not afraid of that kind of stuff. Yeah, well. No, I mean, he's been always a kid I'm that's grabbed snakes and stuff n- like that. I. You know, you see where I am. He's always been but like that. I'm not going, I, I don't, the problem is if you're not paying attention, you step and you're a rattlesnake. I mean. Yeah, he, you know what my so, nephew said? He said, where do most men get bitten by a rattlesnake? On the hands and the face. Where do the women get bitten? On the ankles. Yeah. It's because men are stupid. Yeah, but we're goofy. I, I would say, I would think I can handle one. <laughs> I've tried to catch him. I tried to catch a, a, a baby copperhead before. And I, I actually kind of had it, and then somebody stomped it. I said, no, because somebody was right with me, they just stomped it. And I would have to do that for it. I don't know. So, but yeah, he makes his own kombucha. But I'm going to, I asked him about cutting a bottle. And he said he got one of his father's, my oldest brother's, um, bottle cutter so it was probably an old one that he found in the closet and he said he got it um to work once yeah but he, 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 was, he cut... was probably like 14 years old he did that kind of stuff as a kid how do you know you i know because i grew up with he him he said he said he's tried it many times he says, he says i think i got one to work, uh, work out of it yeah but he's he he's the kind of kid that would always go and do something and to figure it out he probably just my brother probably is like oh that's dangerous don't play with that or something i'm gonna try it 
I'm gonna come back in another video, right, in a minute. I'm gonna get my stuff and I'm gonna try it. All right, you want me to try it? I will try it. I, I think I can do it. I think I can do it. I'm gonna do it. All right, so I'll be right back and I'm gonna do the uh, glass cutting. All right. Good night, Ramblers. Okay, see you in a few minutes.